We're hearing from an independence man about his concerns getting mail delivery, and we're hearing from a U.S. senator as well. Investigative reporter Matt Fleener continues to get answers about concerns with the Postal Service. It was last month a man mailed four packages from the Englewood Station Post Office here in Independence. I bottled this stuff up in 87 and started selling it. John Kramer's been selling his antique improver and clarifier for decades. Brings out the color of the wood, enhances definition of the grain. So this sharpens straight across. This craftsman and woodworker has sharpened his recipe over the years, selling to people across the country, but recently ran into trouble getting his products there with the post office. Here's one that went to San Luis Obispo, California. It was delivered January the 11th. It was shipped January 2nd. This is College Station, Texas, February the 8th. He says the four packages he sent from the Englewood Station post office took more than a week, one more than a month. I don't try and use them anymore because I, I can't get my customer decent service. It's interesting that some people get one day's I get a mail in five days, so five days of mail crammed into one day. Senator Roger Marshall on the Kansas side has heard complaints too, saying he's organizing both Missouri and Kansas members of Congress to demand changes of the post office for its slow service. They've got 110 reasons, but at the end of the day, people are not getting their mail on time and something's got to give. Keep publicizing it. Hold their feet to the fire. Kramer says he's speaking up to demand changes too, saying he won't use the post office to ship his creations any longer. Matt Fleener, KNBC 9 News. The Postal Service didn't respond to our requests about Mr. Kramer's story.